Would you believe me if I told you there was a Ziploc bag of dirt loaded with gold sitting in this truck toolbox for the last 10 years? This is insane. Flake. Andrew, this is insane. <laughs> it's insane. This is crazy. Look at that. This thing's full of gold. My buddy Brandon invited me to his cousin Andrew's house where he said he had a bag of dirt he thinks might have gold in it. Look at that. Gold right there. Got all stuck. I jumped in with Brandon and we navigated recent Humboldt County storms to get to Andrew's farm. We unloaded the bag and its contents, which had turned into a hardened dirt slurry. So to dissolve it, we soaked it in a pan of water before feeding it into the gold cube for processing. But where did this dirt come from? From a, an old unknown wash plant. He says unknown wash plant, but I've heard the real story, so. <laughs> I can't tell you exactly where it was found, but it required getting past a mummy army, climbing on top of a giant mountain, finding a man with the umbrella standing next to this tree somewhere in California. We got busy setting up the gold cube, which we would use to process the hopefully gold rich dirt through. This is a four stack gold cube with custom riffle mats from Washington Beach Mining and Dream Mat to catch every speck of gold. Andrew and his son Cooper fed the material into the gold cube with the help from Luca. Oh, After feeding some of the dirt, we stopped to check the top mats. You ready to see all that gold? Yeah! Oh my god! <laughs> I love it. There's gold everywhere. There's a huge one right there. That's a keeper. They continued to feed the dirt into the gold cube, and it wasn't long until they finished and transferred what was caught in the riffles into a pan. This is insane! Andrew, this is insane! <laughs> it's insane! This is crazy. Look at that. This thing's full of gold. Oh, look at all that. That's all flower gold right there. Oh, this is gonna get wow. stupid quick. Wow. This is gonna get stupid quick. There's gonna be so much. Cool. <laughs> Look at that. I hate you. <laughs> I found more in just a little dirt like that and I've been digging for like, you know. The clean out was loaded with fine, fine gold. All right, let's, this is crazy. This is nutty. All right, let's pan this out now. <laughs> this is only, three of the trays. <laughs> we got that whole other one to do as well. With the amount of gold we found, we made sure to get every last speck. Even cleaning out the Ziploc bag, it was stowed away in. You're gonna find more gold in this bag than we did yesterday. <laughs> right? <laughs> I have a feeling. Bag. I have a feeling. Everybody's <laughs> here. So silly. So, I mean, look at that. There's pieces. And it goes all the way up in that corner. Left there, look at that. <laughs> oh my. Wow. Oh my gosh, dude. Yeah, that, right there on that rim. That is, that's an, that's crazy. Yeah. Like, there's probably like six pieces. You got your vial. Just shoot it in there. All right. I think you have enough so you can go, you, you know, get at least one fry for yourself. <laughs> <laughs> No, actually, you got a good amount, so that's awesome. I'm probably get a number one. I was about to say, right? <laughs> Big Mac. Baby. Yeah. You know, medium. But you can't go <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. 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 <laughs> Ice water. Right. No McFlurry. <laughs> <laughs> I cleaned up the pan a bit more, and this was the most and only gold I had seen inside a Ziploc bag of dirt. Got some gold. <laughs> Look at that. Gold. Oh, yeah. Make sure to follow or subscribe for more family gold finding adventures.